Industry celebrates Activair Air Freight's 30 years of excellence. From the time when I started or joined the industry almost four decades ago, uh, when I was the first management trainee in a private company, right out of my college, there used to be manual shipping bills to be filed and clearances and everything was all manual. Over the years and time, it has all started and happening electronically, which is a great help and great reforma uh, reformation in the uh, clearance processes, which used to take days are being done in minutes or hours. So I think there has been a lot of change which we have, I have gone through. Active Air started in 1994 on 13th of June and today we are celebrating the 30 years and without everybody's help, contribution and support, we could have not reached this milestone. Mr. Govil, my dad, started this. He learned the tricks of the trade. We've been working with um, Govil, Chandrama, Abhiyank and the whole team um, here in Delhi. Uh, for the last 15 or more than 15 years actually. Uh, we started the association in the UK um, and then we developed it further into the United States. Samir Shah discusses recent merger of JBS and Gina and company. Here were two families who knew each other very well, who followed similar principles of managing their companies, who followed sim similar principles of working. And both have their strengths, both had their areas which were complementing each other. So it was more a meeting of the minds, meeting of old friends, who thought that whatever are the areas where the other is strong at, let the other benefit. And whatever are the areas where the other is weak at, it can get covered. So we have ensured that not a single staff has been asked to go. We have ensured that everyone has got uh, absorbed in the merger. We have ensured that every client has been retained. And all we are looking at is a great future together. AQ Worldwide has partnered with ShipBob to provide its ocean and air freight services to ShipBob's receiving hubs and fulfillment centers in the USA, Europe, Canada, and Australia.